second week of September now. And I woke up feeling meh today. I think it has a little more to do with my period than anything else. Yeah. Auntie Flo, Mother Nature, however you want to refer to her. She has officially knocked on my doorstep. Uh, she won't be gone until close to the end of the week. Yay. And I'm one of those people who has... Uh, okay, this might be TMI, but you, you guys already know I'm an oversharer. So, I either have a period where I'm like bouncing off the walls and like hopped up on chocolate and can't stop eating, which is really not great for my figure. Um, <laughs> or I'm one of those who is not very hungry during her period and I'm really like eh, on energy and sometimes it's a mix of both. <sighs> I'm usually over emotional though on every period. So I get a little touchy feeling on my period. Um, I don't know how that came out. I didn't mean it how it sounded, if it sounded weird, but whatever. Um, I said all that to say that when I left, I didn't, I decided not to eat anything before I left because I wasn't really all that hungry. Because, you know, I'm period and I'm just like, I don't really feel like eating anything. I'll eat later. And as soon as I get out here and I was messing with this box in the trunk, which is probably really what ramped up my hunger. But now, now I'm hungry. <laughs> just like, why? Why not want to get out of the room? Because I'm not going back. If I go back up there, I'm not coming back out. So, I don't know. I've been getting me like a little dollar hamburger or something just to sate the hunger. I don't know. I didn't, I, I uploaded my video today that's all I did um, and I, I watched Nia's stream and Steve had a stream and I was going back and forth between those two streams but doing nothing during those streams well no I was reading um, Laura's or Laura's next book um, but I was you know slowly reading at that <sighs> it's one of those days where I don't feel like doing anything maybe reading but not anything that I'm supposed to be doing you know like revisions those things and I had planned on ramping up the amount of time I was going to spend on revisions this week each day because I really need to I only got one chapter done last week which is very pitiful so but I just don't I It's like my shirt. My shirt says, hold on, I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? Can you? Uh, mm. it, it says, please don't make me do stuff with Snoopy sleeping. And yeah, that's how I feel. Please don't make me do anything. Um, anything that makes me use too much brain power, I should say. But with that, I'm, I'm going to go. Um check the video box um I'm gonna go use the Starbucks gift card to get me some Starbucks maybe I'll sit in Starbucks and read for a bit I don't know I just needed to get out of the room even though I really could have gone and done, done laundry today but again I just don't feel like doing anything and now Tuesdays has been laundry day for the last little bit so I'm just gotten used to Tuesdays I'm just, I'm tired. I don't feel like doing anything. And with that, I'm going to go so I can actually drive somewhere. So, yeah. I'll be back to check in later.
now in case she thought I lost my mind and was having that bad of a, of a day or a moment that I needed two Starbucks. I mean, I do have the gift card, so I could get two, but I did not pay for two. Or the gift card didn't pay for two. I ordered a hot white chocolate mocha, triple venti white chocolate mo mocha with soy, no whip. Um, and when I got to the window, the guy was like, well, I guess the new person on the the thing, apparently they made me, they heard cold when I said hot. I don't know how, the two words don't sound alike, but it's fine. He made a cold white chocolate mocha. And he, the, the other guy, I guess the manager or whatever, was like, well, we're gonna give you the cold one. I'm gonna go make the hot one that you actually ordered. I was like, drinks in my mind I'm like, he's like yeah but we're just gonna throw it in the trash anyway so I'm like oh, I'm gonna throw it in the trash anyway I'll take the second one <laughs> he, he not that I don't like y'all know I like iced coffee to an extent I usually just have to have the hot coffee first um I don't I don't like drinking the cold coffee. yeah I'm just so I have two Starbucks coffees now so Yay, I'm just gonna go pop this ice one in the refrigerator and have me my hot one. I'm gonna go upstairs and I'm gonna attempt to do something. I just don't know what the something is. Figure it out when I get there. But I'll check in later. literally not nothing of much value all day I posted a video I, I did that I checked the post office box mm-hmm yep I think that's about all of merit that I did I didn't feel like doing revisions I, I did some beta reading um, for Laura and Deidre um, finishing up Deidre's now yeah, and I'm gonna play in my world um, after this. I just didn't feel like doing much of anything today. I think it's because it's the first day of my period, and I'm just gonna be okay, oh, fine with that. And we're just gonna have to work harder for the rest of the week. But with that said, I am going to end this here, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Not in the morning, but tomorrow at some point. wanted to come on and say hello for the day and um it's 3 57 now and i'm getting ready to go into the laundry mat to wash my clothes and <sighs> okay i'm not having the best day i don't know if you can hear it in my voice but <sighs> could just be my period but just feeling emotional today <sighs> because the storage unit is going to auction my things off tomorrow so so that's that <sighs> starting not to cry on camera <sighs> and I went by to see if they can at least hold let me get her pictures but she said they can't, um, I can't, well, they can't 
go in there right now because it's it's sealed with what they do for auctions sealed up so they can't do anything um what she says um is if someone bids on it or anything like that that she can um have them give them the pictures to hold for me because i just wanted my daughter's pictures because i can't get those back you know so that was emotional and then i got yelled at by the front desk manager well by the manager at the hotel because oh, it was a miscommunication but not really and because of the night that I because Friday night I wasn't no was it Friday night or was it Saturday night mm, it was Saturday night I wasn't able to get the money for Saturday night to stay and um I don't know, I guess I just hoped for a glitch in the system again or to be able to give them the money on Sunday. But, um, um, yeah. So, they, they, they weren't very happy with me. And I got emotional and cried about that. And, yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> so, there's that. I did pay for the room tonight, um, but I don't have the money for tomorrow night. So, <sighs> I don't know. Um, it's just been an emotional day. And I'm gonna go wash my clothes. And <sighs> try not to keep crying. But, um, so yeah, there's that, all of that, and I'm going to go, and I will check back in later. Um, I did manage to get an hour of revisions done, not that that means anything now, but yeah, I'll check back in later. Bye. I say good night now. It's 4 36 in the morning. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Wednesday, date was the date, 13th, 2.48, yeah, I just saw, it's a little early for me, but I'm going to go to Walmart real quick, assuming that I don't run out of gas, because, yeah, I need gas, except for I have no money, um, I just spent the last of what I had for the room tonight, um, I don't know what that's going to mean for tomorrow, Yay. <laughs> I hmm, have to do I'm trying to cope with the fact that my my the rest of my things, including my massive amount of books, are being auctioned off today. Someone's gonna get some really lovely craft books and um old um college textbooks some language dictionaries, all kinds of um, researchy things for writing, along with my fiction books that I treasured very deeply. It's fine. 
I mean, there's really nothing I can do about it. So, it is what it is. I'm going to go to Walmart to see if I can get something for tonight. Stick in the air fryer. And in the meantime, use some of the gift cards that I got to get some lunch. Because I got this gift card. I mean, I've already taken the gift cards out. And I got this one from Wendy's for my daughter. So, I'm going to go do that. So I can already get back. Got some writing to do. Or revising, should I say. If I feel up to it. I'm not entirely sure I do. But we'll see. But yeah. I'll check back in later. I'm back and now the challenge is getting everything upstairs. I only have two arms and my legs don't work so great these days. Bad pain day. So this should be fun. Where are the cards when you need them? Okay. I'll check in later. Bye. supposed to do today? The answer would be no. Um, I just was not in a good head space today because I knew my things were being auctioned off today and it felt like I was being evicted all over again. And wasn't able to get my daughter's pictures, which I think I explained to you before. And it just wasn't a great day emotionally. So I just didn't, wasn't in the right headspace to, I wasn't in the right headspace to do any revising today. So, I read a little and I mean a little um I wrote in my um I planned a little thing some things for YouTube my upcoming videos or experiments for that thing. um in all that planning I still didn't figure out what my videos would be tomorrow but yeah um and I'm working on my down a little town and I streamed and sadly that was all I did and I, I'll probably feel bad about it tomorrow but right now I just I needed the day to not to just not write or revise or worry about any of that so Been, been a, it's been a day emotionally so, uh, in case you're wondering what I'm doing I am putting some cream on 
Uh, remember I, I said I was having break issues with my arm breaking out. I'm still having those issues. So putting some cream on it to hopefully help. But I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna try to make it a better day. <sighs> I'm really truly starting off from scratch because I don't have anything left anymore. Good night. give a much longer hello than this but then I looked at my gaslight hold on let me show you yeah and I don't want the last what happened the last time when I was on camera and my car cut off because it literally ran out of gas as I was doing a clip um yeah I don't want that to happen again so I'm gonna come say hello in full after I go get gas. Okay, it is very, that's very bright. That's very, very bright. Why are you so bright? I don't know. I can't get the light right. Okay, so, hmm. Hello. It's Thursday. What is the actual date? The 14th. And I've paid for the room tonight. Um, I... Um, now the question is have I worked on anything today no no I have not it has been an emotional two three three days which is like most of the week right um ever since I they called me and said they were auctioning off my stuff at the storage unit and it just felt like I was being evicted all over again for a second time and before it was like okay I lost most of the things in my home but I at least still had the stuff in my storage unit so I wasn't like when I got a new home I wasn't starting completely from scratch scratch but now I'm starting completely from scratch scratch and that made me feel emotional for a couple of days. I'm still, apparently I'm getting emotional now. So maybe I should just not talk about it. Um, so I, I wasn't able to concentrate on revisions yesterday. It's shaping up like that again today, but I'm going to, when I get back to the room, try to work on revisions at least for a little bit because 
I really need to get these revisions done, although I am coming to the realization that they probably will not be getting done by the end of this month like I wanted because I'm just really slow at it and they're taking longer than I even I expected them to take and yeah, that's fine that's okay um also comes to the realization that I'm probably not gonna publish the weight of her this year like I wanted to but January hopefully um but I'm gonna say I don't know I had to do a video and I don't know what I'm doing for my video that's gonna be fun but I'm going to go in the store get a couple of things for dinner um, and oh, head back to the room I guess am I going to partake in some Starbucks I don't know. Y'all didn't see it because I didn't film it, but I fixed coffee after midnight last night. Um, yeah, I'm trying to get back in a better headspace to do the things to revise, frankly, because I really need to. But I also need to start drafting on this super secret project that I'm going to be working on soon so there's that and I still need to finish the world building for that so I don't know I don't know what I'm doing everything's just feeling up in the air for the last couple of days but I'll be back to check in later Starbucks and um, I still have to film whatever my video is going to be for the day I'm not entirely sure what that is yet but um, I'm such a creature of habit I was, I was like ooh because the other day they gave me a cold and a hot drink the same drink but cold and hot by mistake I think I y'all remember that and now I'm like, I like the cold one. It's good. It was really good. And I can make a hot one, hot coffee in the room. Hmm. But when he asked me if I wanted um, cold or hot, I just went with my normal hot. Um, but yeah, I just got some, I think I'm fixing sal salmon tonight. Salmon, salmon, salmon. You know, I've been saying salmon practically all my life. I'm going to keep saying salmon. I know that that's probably not the correct way to say it, but yep, salmon. Um, that's what I'm fixing tonight. Um, actually, I'm going to fix two different because she wanted salmon. I'm getting fixing her the regular salmon with no... I got stuffed salmon, so stuff with like seafood. It was supposed to be stuff with um, real crab meat, but you know, because of inflation and everything, they don't really use real crab meat anymore. But it's it's seafood stuff. So I got that one because I wanted that one. And but she doesn't do all the extra seafood stuff, so that's fine. Okay, it's my turn next, so I will check back in later, maybe. I'm not sure. my my longer form experiment 
which was inspired by Kate Cavanaugh. Oh, whose was inspired by one of her patrons. Um, Cause if I announce it, then that means I have to do it. And I've been putting it off and taking so long to get it together and you know, whatever. So if I just go ahead and put it out there, gotta do it. So that's, I think that's gonna be my video. But I'm gonna go upstairs. I'm tired now. All right, bye. three in the morning I'm not going to bed but I am closing this clip out for the day see you guys in the morning I don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow we'll see you together I'm doing this in the room and oh, at least while I have the room, uh, I haven't actually been able to pay for it yet, so so that's how my day is going. Um, I, don't, I don't know how it's going to turn out today, so I'm crossing my fingers and praying for miracles right now. But, in the meantime, I'm distracting myself by getting ready to stream with the lovely Emma Bennett. Um, because I, I was invited on her stream, I'm so honored. And so I'm, I'm kind of backstage now. Uh, hold on. <laughs> Me, backstage. But, yeah, here we go. Try to work on revisions while I'm super duper stressed out. We'll see how that works. I'll be back. We'll let you know. Oh, hello. I figured I haven't come on much to talk today because I didn't really go anywhere. And usually I only come on to talk when I am in the car for the most part. Um, if you hear noise in the background, it's because my child is in there taking a, a late shower. Um, but I did manage to finally secure the room for the night. I don't know how tomorrow's gonna go, but you know, one day at a time. Um, yeah, I'm just, I hate this place. This, I'm not, not here. This place is in here, is in the hotel. I mean, the place I'm in, having to do night tonight and just having to stress about whether I'm going to be able to stay from night to night again. And I'm just so over this. I'm so ready to not be in this place. And I know people keep saying, 
better is coming and I, I was joking when I said earlier to the the girl at the front desk because she's like you look so depressed what's wrong and I'm just like you know people keep telling me better is coming and I'm just like when when's better gonna get here because uh, you know I mean it can it, 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 it hurry up now <laughs> better must have lost my address then again I remembered I no longer have an actual address so better you know I guess it's getting rerouted I don't know I mean I am I am trying to remain optimistic but you know some days it just, it just feels like better is not getting here quite as quickly as I would like it to but with that said she's now getting ready to come out and y'all know I don't really like talking much in front of her where she can actually hear me since her earbuds are not in because she's getting ready to come out of the bathroom I'm gonna go and I'll be back to check in later <laughs>
as per usual, if you would like to be supportive of me in any of my creative endeavors, such as my blog, my online magazine, my online store, Kofi page, my GoFundMe, or by buying my books, all of those links can be found in the description box below, along with some new channels for you to peruse and check out. Um, and yeah, um, that's it for me this week. Y'all take care of yourselves and have a blessed day. Bye.